morning YouTube over here on the call after another technician um, I guess he changed the indoor motor and found the head pressure to be doing a lot of funky stuff so he's off sick today and my work order said to recover the refrigerant check for restrictions I know this is a piston system so that could be a source of issues and then the uh, change the filter dryer and uh, get some new gas in it see what it does so this is where I'm at I'm excited to try the new VP85 pump over there with the half inch Appian hoses I hope I'm impressed it was not cheap anyways that's what we're doing just waiting on the recovery now so so I went ahead and got the system recovered I got the new dryer on I know it's a little funky looking but it serves a purpose it's a bi flow for a heat pump uh, I pulled the piston out here at the unit um I don't see anything wrong with it so I'm gonna go check the indoor one let this line cool down and tighten it back up well it turns out the indoor piston was all gunked up here's a picture of it I actually cleaned it already and forgot to get video um, I keep a can of R11 in the van and a little baby food jar. Works really, really well. I just shake it around in there. Cleans it out real good. As you can tell, I'm in Florida. That's a thermocell. Super sweet tool for deterring uh, mosquitoes and keeping them around, uh, away from around your workspace. Anyway, I'm going to get the Appian set up the field piece set up and start vacuuming man I'm pretty happy with this 126 at 1100 it's a two-ton heat pump wide open system I left the ballast open till it started registering under 2000 I'm just running it straight in with the half inch hoses 1100 at two minutes that's great all right we're reaching the 20 minute mark it's about 700 since it's reached nine it's been averaging 30 to 50 a minute so i'm cool with that here we are at 30 minutes 590 I just realized when I came over here to look around I had forgotten to shut the valve on the Hillmore tool. Really no big deal. Everything's tight. I'm just kind of waiting for it to finish up. Alright, she's up and running. I'm going to paint this uh, goofy ass dryer. I just don't like them. I have had complaints. Anyway, there's the analog reading. I've got my testos set up, but they're actually on this phone, so I took a screenshot. It's calling for a 13 degree subcool. I was rocking like 13.9, 14. It's a two and a two and a half story system. Um, I'm not super impressed with the field piece vacuum pump on this one. It took about 35 minutes to get to 500, but I'll tell you, um, I didn't use an eye log and maybe I should. It was clean oil. I don't know, I just expected more, but hey, for 
a longer line set and a whole split system, I guess 30 minutes is uh, respectable. All right, you guys. Hope everyone has a good uh, day, weekend, week. I guess it depends when I post this garbage. No one cares anyway. <laughs> ah.